It is election night in Wisconsin. If you're worried you forgot to vote, don't worry. There may not have been any races where you live. The election was just the spring primary. Tonight, there are some city council races, county board races, a school board race, and a referendum. One of those races we're watching, though, is the referendum for the city of Portage, where voters were asked if the city should fund its own emergency services. Voters approved it a little more than 30 minutes after polls closed, and these are the results that you saw being reported by the Columbia County Elections Clerk. And Armand Rahman is live tonight in Portage. He had the opportunity to talk to the fire chief ahead of the polls closing. Armand? Yeah, Eric and Charlotte, as you saw, the referendum passed with some pretty close, pretty wide margins there, 72 to 28 percent, just 30 minutes after polls closed. Now, starting next year, the Portage Fire Department will provide ambulance service to the city and four surrounding townships. Now, the referendum asked voters if they supported increasing the city's annual tax levy by $1.48 million or an extra $304 a year for a home valued at $200,000. This is to pay for the Portage Fire Department to hire 14 EMT paramedics cross-trained as firefighters, buy three new ambulances, and remodel the fire station. Now, I caught up with Chief Troy Hazi earlier, and he says he recognizes it's a big ask in property taxes, but will provide the best care for residents. It's kind of a leap of faith, and so when people um, give us the support that is needed to make this referendum uh, pass, you know, I really appreciate it, you know, and it won't be taken lightly, that's for sure. I mean, I'm going to spend every dollar very carefully, just like if it was my own money. The chief says starting as early as tomorrow, they'll begin ordering equipment that uh, have a 24 week waiting time. Then they'll go through the paperwork with the state to be licensed as an ambulance service. Now, this all came about after the hospital in the city was bought by the company Aspirus a few years back, and they began charging the city for ambulance service that was free of charge for years before. Now that the referendum has passed, the city won't have to reduce services like snow removal in order to fund a third party company taking over the ambulance service. For now, live and moving forward in Portage, Armand Rahman, News 3 Now.